Hey guys, welcome. Welcome to Artistic License, my Thursday stream where we do a variety of stuff. It's kind of whatever I want. Um, and today we're going to be playing another round of Final Fantasy X. Hey, Erica. Hey, Lilith. I don't, which, which do I call you on Twitch? Do I call you Erica or do I call you Lilith? <laughs> I'm unsure. <clears throat> welcome. Welcome, guys. Um, I got some, uh, some new stuff. Thump, is Thumper in here? Thumper, are you in here? Make yourself known. Answer to both. Oh, good. That's good to know. Thumper, are you here? I have something for you. Oh, maybe they'll pop. Hopefully they'll pop in soon. I, uh, I played around with some of the spell reagents down in the thing below the chat because I know some of y'all that are attending a lot of these probably have a lot of those saved up. So I added a nice... Uh, big one so y'all can see y'all can use that if you have a lot of reagents saved up currently the only viewer viewer according to the users in the chat thing yeah i feel like that thing updates so slow though so i never trust it like it'll it'll say something and then it's always like slightly different um and then i look at the stats later and it's like super delayed i feel like what it tells you who's in the chat and uh and who's not yeah the become the cupcake so if you are not a patron or a um, Twitch subscriber or anything like that, but you want your name listed up higher in the cafe Discord server, you can become the cupcake uh, as somebody that comes to the streams and participates in them a lot. That way you can have your name up a lot higher in the cafe. All right. All right. Let's, let's get into our first little mini topic. Bree! Bree, yeah. <laughs> it's a yellow kind of day today. I feel like it's starting to get a little warmer. You know what I mean? It's not quite so freezing out there. Thumper! There we go. Hey, I just gave this announcement, but this is for you. There's a new reagent down there for you. Hopefully you like it. Something you can spend lots and lots of points on. <clears throat> Come back to you next month. Oh, okay. No worries, Erica. Hey, no one is um, pressured to, uh, to sub or do their prime sub for me or whatever. I know you'll probably watch more people than just me. Uh, or most of you probably do anyway. Hey, Jane, welcome, welcome. Oh my gosh, all of my friends are here tonight. I feel so loved. <laughs> oh yeah, um, I do too. I try to like rotate my Prime sub around to a couple of different people as well. It really just depends on who's streaming next though, when it's kind of like time for me to re-up my Prime sub. So mm -hmm. if you want to become the Cupcake Thumper, you can, and then I'll fix that up for you after the stream. Okay, so I released yesterday, I released yesterday a video about Mary Sue's, and I just wanted to talk really briefly about that. Um, this video did pretty well for my channel. I mean, I, I don't get a lot of views or anything like that, right? Very small channel, so uh, the comparisons are not, like, super big between the videos, but this one did pretty, pretty well. Uh, most of my, like, basic basic videos I feel like do way better like I really legit think that <laughs> I really legit think a lot of people just want their opinion validated you know so they click on the video where they're like I already know about that let me see if Karen says what I would say <laughs> the cupcake you can become the cupcake Brie you can become the cupcake if you have lots of channel points saved up because there's been a couple of people like Thumper in particular that show up to like literally almost every stream so they've got a lot of spell reagents and uh, <laughs> not much to use them on because my chat moves slow, right? So there's, a, you know, I don't have a need to have a lot of different things down there. So, uh, so yeah, hopefully that will make you feel uh, like you saved them up for something awesome. Um, so this video. So <laughs> I do know, though, that for this particular video, there were some people that were maybe not so validated um it was literally like the third comment the third comment that i got on this video was something like oh but the male mary sue is called a gary stew and here's a bunch of examples of male mary sues and it was like whoosh it was like whoosh oh my gosh oh, wait why isn't the sound alert working that was definitely supposed to play a sound what is happening Hang on. Hang on.
Uh, let's see. I'm checking these sound alerts. It works when I do the test. Why isn't it working when y'all do it? Did y'all see it when I ran that test just now of a whistle? It's slash. Hmm. I have no idea why that's not working, but you heard it. Well, yeah, I mean, that's what you're, what's supposed to happen. Okay, yeah, I can play the wow. Why aren't you working? Wow! Yeah, I can play it. Why can't Brie play it? I'll have to troubleshoot that because I just switched it over to this sound alerts, which is much nicer, right, than what I was doing before, but it's not working for some reason. Well, let me see if I can Google it real quick. Sound alerts not playing on stream. Okay, it says if I go to setup, let's see if we can fix this right now. Hopefully it's this. Um, and then it's really easy. So there's apparently on the setup, where is that? Give me one second, I think I can fix this. <laughs> we'll get those sounds working again. I definitely want y'all to be able to do those. Okay, alert box, select the bits. Apparently there's something I see, oh, there it is. Alert box, then bits. Okay, so the test works. This, this is, is a test, a test bit bit alert. alert. Uh -huh. Sorry, y'all are hearing the test. Okay, alert variations. Let's see. Variant section. One of those variants is probably overriding your alert. Okay, so let's see. Okay, I enabled all of them. If that didn't fix it, I'll have to test it again later. Um, hopefully that fixed it. Let's see. Okay. Well, I tried. If that didn't fix it, I'm sorry. But if somebody else wants to try another sound again, I'll, then I'll research this after the stream. Okay. Anyways, back to this video. So I... It was not but like three comments in that somebody was like, oh, but it's a Gary stew and here's all these examples. And like, it was like, whoosh, right over their head. I feel like the whole video was like freaking right over their head. Ah, Jane, thank you for following. <laughs> you were already following me though, what's up? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, Brie, it's not working. I really don't know why, um, I'll have to figure it out. I, the test works, but the real one doesn't, which is really a shame. Um, but I will, I will work on fixing that and figure it out. Don't know what's up with that. So yeah, <clears throat> so I just feel like, I feel like maybe, I don't know if the point was like not clear enough or like if, um, if, the, if the, the person just didn't watch the whole video, like I don't know, obviously on an individual basis if they don't watch the whole video. But I think if the point wasn't clear enough, here was like the point of the video, that critiquing how annoying a flawless character is was not the point, right? Like it's not about critiquing how annoying a flawless character is. It's about when we see the word Mary Sue used to do this, it's typically not a critique. Like at least in my experience, the person that's using this word, like that's not what they're trying to do. Like they're trying to do something totally different. So if I see someone giving that kind of critique and they use the word Mary Sue, like it's usually not really that. And I'm a little bit suspicious of it. And like, here's all my reasons why and the history of the word and who tends to use it and da da da. Like that's what the video was really supposed to be. But the point wasn't clear, that was the point. All right, y'all, let's get to the fun stuff. Um, let's get to the fun stuff. Let's see. Get the game going. Okay. 
Come on, Twitch. Find the game. Here we go. Let's turn the sound up for you guys. Probably about right there. Okay. Your eyeliner in the vid was moi. <laughs> Y'all never believe me, but I legit don't wear eyeliner. It's just mascara. It's just mascara and good lighting. That's literally all. <clears throat> I should probably wear some eyeliner though, because then I could look like real awesome. But I really don't. I really just wear mascara and then I wear um, lipstick. Them's your real lashes. Yes, these are my real lashes. It's kind of a shame, right? Like, because I'm um, kind of, because uh, I'm kind of pale, that uh, you don't really see them. Okay, this is Lord Ochu. So we are going to kill him. Here's what we're going to do. First thing, uh, cheer up. Cheer up, everybody. Okay, and let's get everybody attacking at least a little bit. Okay, you can do one Kimari. And who do I want to use for this battle? Who do I want to use? I definitely want to get Lulu in here. So let's get let's get Lou in here. It's gonna do her fire. Fire fire. You can use fire on a lot of the bosses in this early part of the game, and I like using this spell. I think it's a really good one. Okay, no, I wanna keep walking in here. Let's keep him in here. I've been switching up my eyeliner game lately, but I haven't been streaming so no one has seen it yeah I haven't seen a stream from you in a while um I I miss it like the I think I've watched maybe one or two streams of yours they were really good um so I want to see that more I think does he have no I think that's the next one okay well just so that she can do something let's just cast uh not yet well someone will get poisoned so actually let's go back to let's do Titus yeah, it's so nostalgic for me too, Brie. Have you played this game? Or is this, um, because I know for some people that have been watching this particular stream, this is a uh, new for them. This is a new Final Fantasy game for them. They hadn't played this one. It's been like two months. Oh. So maybe in February. Yeah, you should. Um, you definitely should. I would like to see it. I think you played some, you played some kind of, oh, I can't remember what the name of the game was called. Mm -hmm. Dang it. I'm talking and not paying attention to the thing. <laughs> uh, some kind of like you were moving around a map and stuff. I know, it looked really good. Okay, let's do this. Uh, I need Yuna to do something. So why don't you just wake him up? Yeah. This guy, you don't want him to go to sleep, because essentially if you let him sleep, like if you're like, oh, he's asleep, I'm gonna heal up. Like, don't do that, because then what essentially will happen is he'll just kill heal, and then the fight will last for freaking ever. Ah, oops. Oh well, there we go. I think I just got an idea for my next empire. Space. I could make Freya- oh yeah, yeah! Make Freya in that game! That would be awesome! Yeah, Erica's Lilith. Oh, it's secure. We're gonna save her. Save her overdrive. For later. You got good evasion, Lulu. Good job. Good job dodging. So I want fire. Fire, fire. <laughs> oh, y'all are cracking me up. Okay, let's um walk but we've made him suffer enough. Okay. Yeah. Going going by real first names on the internet. I didn't used to. I used to use a pseudonym, right? But um then when I started the YouTube channel I was like, that's not very like professional sounding. Let me switch. So then I did. Yeah. <laughs> I can totally understand that. That's exactly what I did for a long time. Dead, yeah. 
Okay. Sweet. Whoa. A it's summoner so and her guardians. Very impressive. Should be. Sir, we should fight too. We'll get our chance soon enough. Young crusaders gather around. We'll be sent into the ground. Yeah. That's some good energy there, Luzu. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, Bree, I guess you weren't actually here for my name change, so you wouldn't have known. I didn't mean to save, I just wanted to heal up. Okay, Focus let's actually go. No worries. Let's actually go and get the next guy. <clears throat> oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Um Yeah, I mean at the time it's kind of like you know, I don't really want when you're just role-playing and you don't have like anything else that you're doing. Really, like, you don't want that to be connected to, uh, <laughs> to anything that anyone could find. But, um, but now it's all out, you know. And I do other things to kind of, like, protect exactly what we're role-playing and that sort of thing. Oh, finally connected them. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I understand now. Yeah! There we go. You've always been brief. The whole time that I've known you. Just didn't want strangers googling me. Yep. Yep. Totally understand. And my first job was in tech too. And uh, and so, yeah. <laughs> Same exact concern. I don't really do tech anymore though. But sometimes I still end up going back to my tech roots. And I end up getting given jobs like, Oh, Karen, you can do the wiki design because you know how to do that stuff. And I'm like, sure. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be done with, like, um, random battles for a while in a little bit. We just gotta get back through the forest. I know we already traveled through it last episode, but we gotta do it one more time. We can get past it. Web designer for 10 years. Oh, that's so cool. I knew you had done something like that, because I, I knew you had a lot of graphic design skills. Let's see, there we go. This is the best Final Fantasy game, y'all. Okay. No more random battles. Come on. Ah, oh, I knew it was gonna happen. <laughs> well, if you count the hobby days, right? Um, I feel like that applies to so many of us. Uh, I mean, I definitely learned how to do like HTML and web design and all of those sorts of things on uh, MySpace and LiveJournal. <laughs> I did not learn it professionally. Yeah, I do feel like that's kind of true, um, Brie, as far as like what people did on Tumblr. Most people used, like, if it wasn't their real name, I guess it was something that sounded like their real name, so we just kind of all sort of thought that's what it was. They just give out, like, real first names, you know? But, you know, that's not the internet I came from, because that was not the way that the internet was years ago. Like, not even close. It was just, like, you didn't do that. You always had, like, a pseudonym that you were using when I was a kid on the internet. That's what I assumed in your server. Yeah. <laughs> and a lot of people are obviously using pseudonyms, but some not so much. Okay, cutscene time, y'all. I'm gonna be quiet oh, for a second. Oh. These stone steps have a history, you know. Yep. Lord O'Holland trained here at his peak. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> A race, huh? <clears throat> Think you can beat me? Yeah. <laughs> Yuna, if you would. Uh, ready? <laughs> oh, you all lose. Ah, huh? Hey! <laughs> okay. I guess we're not racing. Mari still won't talk to me. I understand. Like, I get it. You're a Detroit Lions fan. I'd be sad too. Kids. Kids. She says that like she's in her early 20s and she's like kids. Like come on now. Okay, we're going to save right here. 
Boiler Jane is not my name. Yeah, I think we knew that. I feel like, or I feel like I knew that. I don't know if everyone did. Oh shit, what's going on? Everyone, quick, sin spawn. More tentacles, y'all. Tentacles are sin. That's how it is. Okay, so the way you gotta do this fight is you have to, like, kill the tentacles first. Because they'll block, uh, I think it's Lulu's magic that they block. And then we're gonna use her magic to basically kill him. So, let's actually switch out to Yuna. And then... He has, like, a water spell that he uses, so I want to get some Null Tide going. Boom. Bye. My name is Ralph. <laughs> I don't believe you. <laughs> are you, are you, uh, Ralph from the Ralph Wiggum bus meme? I'm in danger. That's my horrible Ralph Wiggum voice. No, Ralph is in Vom. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, you're so gross, Jane. No, no Vom in the chat, please. Please chat, no, none of that. <laughs> okay, so now what we can do is let's swap in Lulu, and let's fire, fire! Yeah. Okay, and then... I want to actually bring in Waka, and let's let's try to stop that spell from even happening. There we go. Silence My for you. How about magic? Like I know that Waka. I know. I just told them how to do the fight. Okay. Mm, no, actually, let's do this. Try this. Let's chia. Yeah, chia chia. Boss music, the standard boss music for this game is so intense. <laughs> Whoa! It came out of its shell. Alright. So, do I want to use... Yeah, let's use Yuna's. Let's use her overdrive. Why not? So, her overdrive is so cool. Because you essentially get to summon your Aeon with the full uh, overdrive. Their overdrive already full. So we can use Balafor's Overdrive. Come to me, Boo Bird. Get the Sin Spawn and its tentacles. Okay, and see how I got the second one? Right, we'll use that next, but we haven't even shown off Energy Blast yet, so let's do that one. We'll do Energy Ray next time. He whips his hair back and forth. He whips his hair back and forth. Overkill! When you overkill the bosses, you get extra loot. So, if you can do that, that's awesome. Like, I should have saved Lulu's overdrive to overkill the other one. But I didn't. Because I wasn't thinking about that. So that's what I should have done. So many battles. <laughs> Sorry about that. Hope to break you in a little slower. B being a guardian's tiring. You handle yourself pretty well. You got talent. Hey. Thanks. So what are these sin spawn anyway? Fiends. They fall from Sin's body and are left behind in its wake. Leave him alone and Sin comes back for him. You gotta be quick. That moment when Waka told me I had talent in battle. I think that was when I started seriously considering becoming a guardian. It's Final Fantasy X. Um, this is specifically the Final Fantasy X uh, HD remake version. Yeah. Huh. Oh, this is my favorite one. They got fiends in Xenacan too. The story's amazing. Just a few. It's a big deal when one shows up, though. Uh, hey! Hey, since when have you believed me about Xanarkin anyway? I've been thinking. 
Maybe people sin gets to don't die. Maybe sin carries them through time, like a thousand years through time. And then one day, maybe they just pop back, see? Amazing. Simply amazing. Hmm? You make up one theory after another, refusing to face the simple truth. Oh. Sin didn't take Chapu anywhere. Sin crushed him and left him on the Jose shore. Your brother won't just pop back. Oh, and one more thing. No matter how much you want it, no one can take Chapu's place. No one can replace Sir Jack, for that matter. And there's no replacement for Lord Braska either. He's so harsh. It's pointless to think about it. And sad. Oh, she's so frustrated with him. I... I could never be what Chapu was. Well, stuff happens. Best not to worry. Waka, Lulu, and Waka's brother, Chapu. Something had happened between them a long time ago. I was sure of it. Yes, that well, was obvious. Well, whatever it was, it was none of my business, that's for sure. Best not to go there. Mm. See all the fire around this temple? So cool. A little clue on what's to come in here. So back to that scene we just watched, that Chapu scene for a moment. This is what I love about this game. Like, the story is so freaking good, right? There's, like, all these different things going on, different things between the characters. Like, Titus has this encounter with Sin, right? And he's teleported. So then Chapu is supposedly, is this, is a character that was supposedly a lot like Titus. We don't get to meet him, right? Um, since Waka's not our main character, we don't have, like, flashbacks with Chapu or anything. But uh, but his encounter with Sin ended in, in death. So it's like, it's all these like, and there's more of them. Like there's another one, hopefully. I think they'll say enough that I'll talk about it because I'm trying not to do spoilers, right? Um, we'll see if that we'll get to later in this episode. Okay, let's talk to some of these people. You sure are talented, man. Playing blitz ball and fighting like that. Yes, I can do it all. So this is the place honored in remembrance of High Summoner O'Holland. Makes you kind of nervous, yeah? Uh, not really. I'm going to pray real hard so that Sin doesn't come back here. Good idea. Climbing those stone steps every day has kept me in shape. Haven't caught a cold in years. Well, there we go. We all just need to walk upstairs. I hear the Crusaders are going to fight Sin without the aid of the Summoner. That sounds like a bad idea. Hey, they've got another thing coming. Haven't they ever heard of Divine Retribution? Well, that's a little dramatic. I don't know about that. I've had enough of Kilika. Too many tearful memories here. Ah, thanks for the follow, RBC Gaming, or Games, sorry, RBC Games. We came to visit the temple one last time before we leave for good. We've decided to leave Kilika and look for a place without sin. Oh, I don't think that exists. Who knows if we'll ever find it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think you will. I heard famous people come here. Where could they be? Me, I'm famous. Oh, welcome back, Thumper. I hope you got yourself a good snack or something. Uh-oh, who are these losers? You here to pray for victory too? Us? Pray? Who needs to pray? The Luca goers always win. Oh yeah? Then why are you here? We've been praying for some competition this year. Oh, bird. So what's your goal this time? You gonna do your best again? Ha! It's too bad your best isn't good enough. Why even bother showing up? This time, we play to win. Hmm. Ooh, play away. Victory. Just remember, even kids can play, boys. See you in the finals. Yeah. Take one of these. We'll beat them. We have to. You know that, team? Putting people down. They're as bad as my old man. But Sir Jack was a kind and gentle man. Well, not my Jack. You didn't know him. <sighs> Even ten years after he left, just thinking about my old man got me angry. <laughs> but maybe that was just my way of keeping him. Nah. nah. Oh, was that almost a breakthrough there, Titus? <clears throat> 
Welcome back, Thumper. Glad to have you back. Have to be social. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think sometimes you have to do that for family. I understand. Wait, is there anything in these side doors? I can't remember. Let's go look. May the Killica Beasts win this year's tournament and serve as a sign of encouragement and hope for the people of Killica. Oh, man, you know what? They kind of deserve it. He has a point. Killica Temple is the Temple of Fire. Even the Cloister of Trials is engulfed in flames. That's right. Those who disobey the precepts and enter unsanctioned may forfeit their lives. Yep. The O'Holland's Temple, and it's all about fire. I'm supposed to study real hard and become a nun, but I just want to run around and play at the beach. Don't we all, kid? But some of us have to be nuns, I guess. No, I wanted to talk to the other child. I'm here. Guess what? I really like studying the scriptures. The monks give us lots of sweets if we study hard. <laughs> I think you must, might just like the sweets, kid. Okay, let's actually go in. Erica, there's no shame in not playing Final Fantasy, but you should change that and try one. This is a really good one. It's really easy and the story's really good. Ari oh, still doesn't want to talk to me. I just want to talk to you. Okay, what do you have to say? I think Waka needs to do a little more praying. Okay. Sure, probably. Please, let Waka's prayers be heard. Yeah, let's win. Lord O'Holland, guide our feet. I'm sure he's listening, my dude. Okay, we're gonna pray too, of course, just like we did last time. Wanna be supportive of our friends, even if we don't believe. <laughs> Apparently, he is. <laughs> My name is Yuna, from the Isle of Besaid. Donna? That so, outfit? So, High mm. Summon Nebraska's daughter. That's quite a name to live up to. My, my, my. And all these people are your guardians? <laughs> my, what a rabble. As I recall, Lord Braska had only two guardians. Quality over quantity, my dear. Whatever were you thinking? I have need of only one guardian. Right, Bartello? She got her himbo. I only have as many guardians as there are people I can trust. I trust them all with my life. Wow. I love how earnest Yuna is. To have so many guardians is a joy and an honor. <laughs> Even more so. He, he speaks later, father. don't worry. <clears throat> of course. I would never think of questioning your ways, either. So, Lady Donna, I ask of you, please leave us in peace. You do what you want, Portella, we're leaving. Bye. Yeah, I mean, some of my party's guilty of this, too, but later on in the Guardian game... Guardian is someone a summoner can rely on. Someone she can trust with her life. I wondered... Did Yuna feel that way about me? What's she smiling about? She's not really smiling. <laughs> he didn't model her smiling that much. I don't understand that line. Anyway, um, later on in the game, we go to a really cold area. And um, some of my party's guilty of this too. But I'm wondering, like, they know this is coming. They're going on this trip on this pilgrimage. And uh, and she's, Donna, where's that? Like, what? Faith is below. Let's do it. What? The faith? But first, the Cloister of Trials. Kamari, Waka, ready? Specifically not you, Titus. Strength, everyone. I want to go too. <gasps> hey! Don't hey, push me gives? around. You're not a guardian yet. Yet. Um, we'll be back as soon as we can, okay? Oh, sure. Soon. Like, tomorrow soon, I bet. Probably. Okay. So what do now? I cannot leave. Uh-oh. I am stuck. In this hallway. Forever. I dive. Whee! 
Maybe. Where's Yuna? Then why are you here? Hey, I'm not a guardian, so I'm not supposed to go in, right? Uh-oh. Why'd you tell her that? Mm, not a guardian, you say? Hey, wait! Ah, let me go! He's such a good guardian, such a good partner. Meeting Donna's unspoken need like that. Hey, she didn't even have to ask him. Idea. He just did it. Just a little game. Huh? Get you a man like that. This is bad. Really bad. Mm hmm Yeah, he has zero brain cells. <laughs> Come on, go up! Go up! Ah, uh, it won't go up. <laughs> but he tries. I'd rather a man like that than the men I usually deal with. Mm. Yep. I wait. I'm not supposed to go in. I'm not supposed to go in. Let me back up. I'm not supposed to go in. Game, why do you make me go in to progress? Only guardians allowed. And I'm sure no guardian. Well, I guess it's too late now. In for the penny, in for the pound. Let's go. Okay, this cloister, this cloister of trials is also pretty easy. And let's see how much I can remember. That's, that's the challenge. How much can Karen remember? You're the main character. The gods demand your presence. It's true. Yes, you do that, Erica. I think that's a good goal. Fire. We burn the door. Take that. It's our door be gone. Okay. Uh, now I think I put it here. Yes. Okay. Now, you hold that. Just, just hold that for a minute for me. Get in there. Yeah. I have the, a fourth birch. Whoa, a fourth date? Oh my gosh, congratulations, Erica. That's awesome. Four dates. She must be a good one. I feel like if they get past three dates, that's like, hey, there might be something there, you know what I mean? Oh, I'm supposed to touch it, not put the thing in yet. Heard the thing, sorry. I go back in there. Okay. Yeah, she's great. Ah, oh, we love it. Okay. Touch glyph. That's what I was supposed to do. It's on Zoom right now because we're in strict lockdown. Yeah, but like maybe if you can keep it going, then once the lockdown is lifted, you can hang out with her. For real, you know? Okay, so that gets rid of the fire down there, I think. Right? Oh no, there's still fire going down there. Uh, I think this goes here. This is the part where I'm really kind of not remembering, but let's see. Let's see if I can do it. I mean, I know the, where the pedestal goes, I just don't remember if it's a helica sphere that's supposed to go in it, or if I'm supposed to leave the glyph sphere in it. I remember. Find out. Scooch, scooch, scooch. Scooch, scooch, scooch. I didn't do it far enough. More this way. I feel like these things in the original, like, PS2 game were a little bit easier to push. It was a little bit more on a grid instead of, like, freeform. There we go. Now I can push it back. Push it real good. Okay, no. I must have to put the Kilika Sphere in there. No. Okay, I'm 
put you back right now. I think I'm supposed to put the Hilligosphere in that pedestal for the next step. Hell yeah. I'm rooting for you. I'm rooting for you, Erica. I believe. There we go. That's what I wanted. Now, we're gonna take you. Oops. We're gonna put you back up here for a second. We have to get the treasure. We cannot leave without getting the treasure. If y'all remember from the first temple that we did, if we get the secret treasures in all of these, then we get a prize at the end. So we have to do that. Here's our prize. Boom! Destruction! red armlet. Okay. Now, since we did that, I have to run all the way back. And we have to put this in the other door. Burning down the door. Fire! Fire! <laughs> This is what we're supposed to do, though. It's so funny. Like, I guess after each summoner goes through here, summoner and their guardians go through here, they come and, like, rebuild all these doors. And then you can just take the sphere with you. So I guess I just have a Kilika sphere in my pocket for the rest of the game. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It was Donna and that big muscle head man. Sorry, Donna and her himbo. Yuna will be the one to suffer the consequences. Sorry. Uh, what consequences? She could be excommunicated. Well, you know what? They picked me up. What was I supposed to do? Just wait. So what's in there anyway? The faith, remember? No. Oh yeah, that thing, right. <gasps> the faith are people who gave their lives to battle sin. Mm -hmm. Yevon took their souls. Willingly given from their still living bodies. Remember that for later. Huh? Now they live forever trapped in statues. But when a summoner beckons, the souls of the faith emerge once again. This game is very That's creepy when you think about it. An Aeon. All that in this room? So, so what's Yuna doing in there? She prays with all her heart for a way to defeat sin. Hey, Lunar. The chamber beyond is a sacred place. Only summoners may enter. What? Even guardians can't go? It's taboo. Oh. Yeah, this Final Fantasy is truly the best story, Bree. <gasps> wow, shoving me around again. Still won't talk to me. I think they only say one thing, but I'm just gonna check. Just wait. So I was always very confused as a kid, like how to progress, and you just have to leave. Try, try to leave. They tell you to wait, but you have to try to leave. Oh, she looked tired. There was something I didn't tell anyone else that day. That song we heard there in the temple. I knew it from my childhood. Oh. It was proof that Spira and Xanarkin were connected. Somehow. At least to me it was. Maybe that's why suddenly I felt like I just wanted to go home. I tried to say something to tell them, but the words wouldn't come. Mm. Poor Titus. Um, we played it two other times, so we played for about maybe three-ish hours. So Ifrit, here we go, we got our fire puppy! 
Um, he's really he's really good. He's a really good Aeon. Uh, do we want to name him? We didn't name the other one. We left him Valifor, but do y'all have a, a name you want to give uh, Ifrit? We can do that. Um, we can name the Aeons. He's a fire dog. That's essentially that's what he looks like. We don't have to. We can keep his standard name if y'all want. Snuggles. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Will it fit? Uh, let's see. Yeah. Snuggles, Ember, Pyro. Oh no, the bots are back and the thing didn't even catch it. Whatever. It's just another viewer, I guess. Is my... Mobbery? How do you say that? Mobbery? In Dragon Age with Snugglemeister. Oh, Ember, Pyroflame. Those are good names. Those are good names, Lunar, but I think we're going to go with Snuggles since um, Thumber th said it first, and uh, and it's funny. Okay. So we, I mean, who doesn't want to snuggle with a fire puppy? Mabari. Oh, okay. And it just barely fits. Look at that. All right. Yes, Snuggles, the fire pup. Okay, we can leave this now. Leave this behind. We completed another Cloister of Trials. All thanks to Titus, the Not Guardian. Looking at I Unit being I famous and thinking of his own. Behind me. Nope. But they were there, and they grew inside me bigger and bigger, till I was just about ready to burst. Are, are you okay? No, I saw I, you being famous, and it gave me flashback. I don't know. What do you want to do? To scream real loud? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Back through the forest. There's some more random battles, probably. Da, 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 da. He wants to be famous. Titus already is famous. He just, you know, wants to go back to that life. Which I understand. Like, once you've been famous, it's probably, like, kind of frustrating. Okay. Let's see. Get him. You have to scream inside your heart on Japanese roller coasters. <laughs> if only Spira had roller coasters. So what have y'all had um, to eat? Have y'all had any good dinners since our last stream? You know, because I love to talk about food. We had, um, uh, uh, Levi makes this, uh, this, like, sort of bulgogi thing. We're not Korean or anything, but, um, but uh, we love Korean food. And the secret is putting gochujang all over your food. So he made some, sliced the pork, like, really thin, and then grilled it with some gochujang the other day and oh my god it was so good it was so good i freaking love korean food that gochujang is delicious to me tuna casserole about 40 minutes ago oh yeah i'm so glad you got the tuna casserole i love me some um some tuna salad some tuna salad on some toast or on some um ritz crackers maybe mm, oh good okay i don't think yeah, we're just gonna kill them. <clears throat> Too hard to get everybody attacking for that particular combination. So there we go. That's fine. You know what I really love? I love salmon. 
Nobody else in my house is a huge fan of salmon, but I really am. I think it's so good. I love to have the salmon and capers and cream cheese. Mm. On a bagel. On like an everything bagel. That's the best. Okay. Look, they built- they rebuilt so much of the- the area. Oh, let's actually do our sphere grid before we embark. We already shopped. We shopped last episode, so... But let's get them their- let's get them their points. Before we go to cutscene city! Do we have any... lock spheres yet? I don't think, yeah, we don't have any yet. Okay. Hulu! Get you some more HP. This way. What is this? Haste! Oh, yeah! Ah, oh, haste is the best. It makes every fight so much easier. Okay, and now she has life, too. Awesome. She can res. Okay, I think that's everybody. Yes, that's everybody. Alright, now let's embark. Let's get... I'm on a boat. Let's get back Off on the boat. At last. The matches start as soon as we get there. So rest up on the way, yeah? Bye. Bye, Kilika. Bye. It's nighttime now, so it is implied that we were literally, like, in that cloister of trials praying to the faith, like, all day. I was just testing the sound alerts while they weren't talking too much. But yeah, it doesn't work when I redeem it the regular way either. Maybe we'll try to fix that after we play the game. We'll do a little more troubleshooting. Yeah, they're screwed up. I added a fancier one, but it doesn't work. Okay, we are on this very rocky boat. Look at how much those lights are moving. Tournament's coming up real soon. Wish we had more time to practice. Yeah, probably everybody does. I just want to sneak up behind them and beat them. <laughs> I mean, I want to get in their faces and show them what we're made of. Yeah! You tell them. Violence will solve it. Why do we have to be on the same boat as the Lucans anyway? Good question. Why do I feel like I'm being watched? What? I always feel like... Those herbs I bought in Killica for, for seasickness are working great. Oh, you're not seasick this time, Bada. That's awesome. There's a little chest right here. Hi, Potion. Looks like our gals are brewing up something back there. I'd be afraid if I were you. What? What's going on? May, my, you're kind of cute too. Want to have some fun? Two! Two! Hey, that boy in the Orox is cute. Oh my god! They got, they got the hots for Bada. They're like, mmm. Look at that. I get it. Oh, she's here. What Some you gotta say? people can be so rude. Yeah, like you. I don't think he will talk to me right Some... here. Yeah, he won't. What's going on back here, sir? It might not mean much, but good luck in the tournament. Oh, thanks, Luzu. Oh, got a sleeping. <laughs> His snoring sound <laughs> cracks me up. He just sleeping on the floor. Best to let him sleep. <laughs> If you say so. Don't know why you didn't get him a bed. I'm sure there's beds on this boat somewhere. A walk is back. I ask a fortune for rags in Beside and Kilika. Well, rags. The business is in shambles. What's an Oaxaca to do? I ask ye. 
I mean, you don't have to be like this, Iwaka. Mind spotting me some gill again, lad? You know what? Yeah, we can do that. It benefits us in the long run, so we're gonna give him a thousand. No sweat. It's make cool. It up to you. Sure you will. I'll make it up. Okay. What do you have? Thank you. Do you have anything? Oh, he's just got potions and stuff. No weapons or anything yet. Oh, how am I doing? I'll get some more antidotes. Okay. What's down here? La, 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 la. <laughs> is the song! Final Fantasy is an RPG. The only one that I need. It's the RPG for me. I think there's another primer in here. Yeah, I knew it. A to E. That's good. No offense, but I'm a die-hard goer. Aww. Good luck, pal. You're gonna need it. You know what? We were doing double duty on the watch to avoid ending up by the like the SS Leaky. Report to us immediately if you see any sign of sin. Okay. I will. Don't know what you're gonna do um, about that, but... <laughs> Binoculars guy runs from me, y'all. Look. Look, he just... Well, oh, say something. I didn't mean to trigger that. Oh, well. Take responsibility. Relax, he's bound to know someone in Luca. And if not? He could always join a Blitz team. Anyhow, it's better than just leaving him in Besaid. What? Just leaving him in Luca? He has a point. What do you want me to do? Yuno wants to make him a guardian. Oh, yeah, jeez. There's that too, eh? And whose fault is that? Not mine. Yeah. You found it. Now you it have to feed heart. it. <clears throat> We're gonna walk up Why again. Why do you think she wants to make him a guardian anyway? Because he's Sir Jack's son. All right. Wait, you sure about that? He's really Sir Jack's son. It's hard to say, but Yuna seems to believe so. Because okay. she's nice and believes people. Okay. okay. That's all you have to say? Well, yeah, I mean, he's got to decide for himself, yeah? Well, him and Yuna, I guess. You're right, for once. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder which is best. There's like four of these. Why don't you tell him he should? Should what? Become Yuna's guardian. Why me? Because Yuna can't. Why not? He hates his father. What he was, what he did. Do you really think she can possibly say to him, I want you to be my guardian, like your father was to mine? Are you being oversensitive? <sighs> not really. All right, all right. He's kind of just I'll being real. To him after the tournament. Be discreet. I know. It's his decision. Okay. Another. He doesn't like his father. Apparently, he told Yuna as much. Hating your own father, huh? Sounds like a luxury to me. I don't even remember my parents. Can't say how I feel about them. I... I was five then, so I remember mine a little. Damn it! Hmm? Sin just takes everything away from us. Okay, last one I think finally. Yeah, because now, now that you can actually walk up there. I don't know why it doesn't just play that whole cutscene at once instead of making you walk up four times, but yeah. <laughs> what hate people referring to my father as sir. I, I assume in Japanese it's like Jetsama or something like that. Um, and that's like, the, so we don't really have that in English. It's the closest fun. equivalent. Tournament starts tomorrow morning. Hey, don't tell me what to do, Waka. I'm sorry. I need some time to think. Okay, I understand. Someone's bound to recognize you when they see your moves out there, huh? You say so. Looks like the toxin's still getting to you. Take it easy and go to bed early. All these people want me to go to bed. Waka is busy right now. Maybe you shouldn't bother him. Too late. What do you guys to say? 
We can finally relax now that the goers are down in the cabin. Oh, if you say so. And the Aurochs are the team to win this year. They say they've got a blitzer from Xanarkand. Oh, team to watch. Yeah, that's me. Oh, come on, you actually believe that rumor? Hot, no way. Only men, it'll be fun to watch. Yeah, you say so. You're the blitzer from Xanarkand, right? At least put up a good fight, you hear me? Okay, I mean, I'll do what I can. I do believe your Xanarkand exists. I really do, you Thanks, know? Yuna. Someone believes in me. I do believe your Xanar Okay, I'm gonna go save real quick because the next thing we're gonna do is really annoying and it's easy to fail and I wanna get it. I wanna be able to reset easily if I fail this. Okay. Let's go. I think I can do it though. Use your game issue, girlfriend. <laughs> they have a lot in common, though, for real. Like, they both have the famous dead dads. <clears throat> They're both uh, famous stars in their own right. They both are very, very earnest. I think they, like, legit have a lot in common. Like, that's what I love about this game so much. Aww, he fell. Well, well. Trying to follow in my footsteps, are you? I usually charge for lessons, you know. That shot is done like this. You can't do it, kid. But don't worry, my boy. You're not the only one. No one else can do it. I'm He's so cocky. Best. It's so annoying. Like, I can totally see why Titus does not like his dad. Like, this is his memory of him. Right? Now, of course, this is through Titus's eyes. We don't really know exactly what Jekt was like from this flashback. But, like, what a jerk. Okay, let's do it. Jekt shot. Yes, I know how. I understand. Thank you. Okay. It's gonna make me practice. Okay. Oh, I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. No one. You're out of your league. You can't do it. You can't do it. You can't do it. You're out of your league. You can't. You're out of your league. You can't do it, kid. Did it, y'all? Knew I could do it. You take that, Jack. Take that. Huh. Yeah, for real, he was. <laughs> Titus is like a little kid, and he's like. Totally stunting on him. Yeah, right. Huh? Whoa! What's that called? Doesn't have a name. Anyone can do it if they try. Yeah, anyone can do it. Show us one more time, yeah? Hell yeah. I'm the best. <laughs> okay. I wanna see. I'm gonna tell Bada and Keepa all about that shot you just did. They'll be so mad when they find out what they missed. <gasps> Is Dotto alright? It's right before the big game and all. Yeah. Talk to me. I feel a little nervous with Lady Yuna watching us. Ah, <laughs> oh, don't feel nervous. He's harmless. I knew, it. I knew you were something special. That's right. Okay. That was the Jack shot, wasn't it? Oh, you oh. knew. Jeez. How do you know that? <laughs> Sir Jack showed it to me when I was a child. <laughs> He called it the Sublimely Magnificent Jekt Shot Mark III. Huh. Stupid name, huh? You know what? There is no Mark I or Mark II, you know? 
My old man said the name Mark III was just something to hook the crowd. He said they'd come back every night expecting to see Mark I and Mark II. And they really did come back. They didn't come back for that. They came back to you as a good so player. Get so mad. <laughs> Is he alive, you think? I don't know. But Sir Jekt was my father's guardian. So he's famous here, too? Yes. So if anything happened to him, I should think word would get around fast. Uh-huh. What would you do if you found him? Who knows? I thought he died ten years ago. Well... I'd probably just smack him one. After everything he put Mom and me through. And because he was famous, I was always... Well, you should know, Yuna. Hmm? Your father's famous too. Everyone in Spira knows him, right? Yeah, that's right. Hmm. Ain't it tough? It is hard to follow in his footsteps as a summoner. Sure. But the honor of having a father like him surpasses all that, I think. Mm hmm Well, there wasn't much to honor about my old man, that's for sure. You shouldn't say that about your father. I got the right. That's right. Mm -hmm. I guess you do. If anyone can say it, it's Ow. Titus. Show me that move again. Yo! I didn't think my old man would come to Luca. He never did like watching other people play. But I couldn't help feeling something bad was gonna happen. And these feelings of mine are usually right. Sure, I had told Waka I'd help him win the tournament, but I wasn't sure I had it in me to play at all anymore. Yeah, we can go ahead and save. The character's voice, Titus's voice, reminds you of your friend? Oh, beautiful, pretty cutscene for Luca. Oh. Um, pretty much everyone that's a voice actor in this game is, like, pretty famous and has voiced a lot of games. You could probably look it up and find, like, a bunch of other stuff he's been in. Like, this game is really like a who's who of, uh, gaming voice actors. Yeah, exactly! Why wouldn't you want to do that? <laughs> Freak yourself out more! I do feel like they deserve the to win, to try and bring considering the that. This year. Exciting, isn't it, folks? Our next team off the ramp is... Well, well, well. If it isn't, the Basade Aura. That's us. They're a living, breathing, statistical impossibility. I've never seen a team this bad. Rude. That's right. In 23 years, they've never made it past the first round. Only a few die-hard fans are in the audience today. Best of luck to them and a safe journey back to Bisset. Right, Jim. Moving right along, our next team is... Here they are, folks. Our very own Luca Goers. Ooh. They've got power, they've got speed, they've got teamwork. They're an all-round first-class team, and they're back home in Luka. Without a doubt, they are the favorite this year, Baba. <laughs> and after the way they dominated last year, it'd take a miracle for them to lose today. 
Well, good thing there's a miracle here. Walking in the background looking so mad. Uh-oh. Titus getting mad now, too. It's like this every year, yeah? Don't let it bother you. Sitting their arms folded, it's clearly bothering you. Stop right there, goers! <laughs> He's such a goofball. You guys are smiling now, but not for long! Because this year, us Aurochs are taking the cup! <laughs> Yeah. In Yevon's name, what you doing up there? We sure stood out, though. We were on the sphere. We were. Maester Micah is here. Already? The number three dot. What's up now? Maester Micah has arrived. That's what. Micah? Maester? Maester Micah is the leader of all the peoples of Spira. He's come all the way from Bavel. The tournament is being held to honor his 50 years as maester. Oh, a long time. 50 years? Shouldn't he be, uh, retired by now? Yeah, he should, hey, probably. Mind your mouth now. <laughs> let's all go see him. Okay. Sure, let's go. I think, is there treasure back here? I think that's on another dock. Yeah. We'll go see him. Bet you anything the lucre goers are gonna win again this year. Maybe so, but you better not count out the Killica beasts. That's right. Maester Micah doesn't get to make many public appearances. He's getting too old for that. Yeah, I bet he's been working 50 years. I'm glad I got here safely. Don't want another SS Leaky incident. Yes, me either. I can catch one glimpse of Maester Micah. I'll have something to brag about back home. Sorry if y'all are hearing that. The dog is drinking water. It sounds really sloppy and gross, I'm sorry. Man, this tournament is gonna walk. Gonna rock! Even the big man is here to see the game. That's right. Okay. Let's save. There we go. Alright. Up here. Yes. Look at that big ship. Bavel's got a big ship. Can't see a thing. Be nice, pick him up, Waka, so he can see. <laughs> That's a guado, right? Who could it be? Isn't that... Maester Seymour? Maester Seymour? What is that hairstyle? <laughs> yeah, I'm waiting for a better shot of him, but um, he has another unfortunate feature. He, he doesn't have a lot of body hair except on his belly. He has a very furry belly. People um, of Spira, I thank you for your generous welcome. Rise, Maester Seymour, and all of you as well. I present to you the son of Maester Jiskel Guado, who departed for the far plain of Fortnite Pass. Oh, we have another the character with a dead know. dad. He has been officially ordained a Maester of Yevon. I am Seymour Guado. I am honored to receive the title of Maester. In life, my father Jiskel worked to foster friendship between man and Guado. I vow to carry on his legacy and to fulfill my duties as Maester the furry to the belly. best of my abilities. Hmm. The Guado are unfortunate in their features. You Bow your head. <laughs> I hope nobody out here is like, man. I have no hair except on my belly. Don't worry, you're valid. You're not like a cartoon character someone designed like that. 
What's that look? Excuse? Excuse? Why are you looking at Yuna like that? Sex you up, yeah? All right, last meeting before the match. Also. No. No, Seymour just makes me uncomfortable. Not psyched up. Okay, sure. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not Waka. What you want? Where's Waka? At the matchup draws. We had to play the Gores in the first match last year. That sucks. The year before that, and the one before that, too. Well, we would have lost to anyone anyway. You don't know that. Captain Waka. <laughs> We're playing the Albed Sykes first. If yeah. we win, we're in the finals. We got by. We got That's by. That's right. We got seated. Two wins, and we're the champions. Hell yeah. yeah. Lucky. First things first. Let's go over the basics again, boys. Oh, we're not going to do... I'm not going to make y'all sit through this tutorial. Um, there's only one thing I want to check in the moving one. I'm just going to do this one real quick. I'm looking for what the button is for a certain thing. Yeah, I know. Oh my gosh, this takes forever. It may seem confusing at first. Okay, it's set to auto. Da, da, da. Yeah, I know. I want the button for the, the other mode. I can never remember what it is. Press Y. Okay. There we go. Okay. That's what I need. It's Y. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Press Y. Switch it back to auto. But we're gonna use we're gonna use the manual movement when we play. Because like the auto movement is just like it's it's hard anyway. But the auto movement makes it harder. I feel like anyway. That when you play Blitzball, that the auto movement makes it way harder. It's really hard to win these first games you play anyway. Because you're set up in the story, right, as this really crappy team. Um, you'll see when we get there. Okay. That's fine. Cool. Alright. We don't need the rest of that. Don't be rude, Titus. He's trying to like give y'all pep talk, and you're just yawning. There you are. Someone said they saw Sir Oren in a cafe. What? They saw uh, Daddy. Oren? Yes, Sir Oren. Let's go find him. Okay. Hey! 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 The game starts like real soon. I gotta go find Orin. You come back quick, yeah? Don't worry. Hey, I'll be back. Yeah, okay. Hey, Waka. <sighs> You're stiff, man. <clears throat> no, no, not your face. Yeah. Just breathe out. Relax. Okay. Like this. <clears throat> Just breathe. Yeah. I'll take a deep breath with Waka. <laughs> Feels better. Maybe now we can find Sir Jekt. Mm, maybe. Huh? How? Sir Oren was also my father's guardian. So, he might know where Sir Jekt is. Okay. I mean, sound Let's logic. Let's go now. It didn't even occur to me to think that the Oren Yuna was talking about. And the one that I knew from Xanarkin could be two different people. I don't know why. But I knew it was the same guy. I knew it was the same Orin. Yeah. Imito Sumana. What? Vasikna Bund. Saying. Hey! Albed Sykes, right? Some Albed saved me the other day, and this girl Riku gave me food and uh <laughs> you don't understand me, do you? Nope. They have no idea what uh... you're saying. Uh, anyway, if you meet Riku, tell her thanks for me. 
You speak oh, louder and the slower, game, they'll understand. May the best team win. Sure. Okay, I know we're supposed to go find Orin, but first we're gonna go find treasure. Once the tournament is over, the operation will commence. Better enjoy Blitzball while I can. They keep talking about this operation. The Crusaders were in charge of guarding the stadium up until last year, but they're all busy preparing for the operation now, but this year the citizens have taken up security posts. That seems really dangerous. Not gonna lie. No admittance. Oh, okay. I, I guess I can't go up there, obviously, but let's go down here. What's that? Another primer! Yeah. V to F. Okay. You sure are taking it easy. The opening match is about to start. Yeah, I know. I'm looking for treasure. Hey, the Oroch's locker room is on the other side, or are you just here to scout? Hey. Oroch's, don't underestimate Ronso's skill. Oh, I will not, lady. Don't worry, I see you. I just want to wish the goers luck, but security won't let me in. Yeah, I wonder why. Guess what, guess what? I shook Bixen's hand. Congrats, kid. This guard's so mean. He won't let me in to see Sir Grav. I've been a huge Goers fan since I was a little girl. I can still cheer as loud as the youngins. Why are these people surprised they can't get into the locker rooms? That's crazy. This is a Luke Rowers locker room, no unauthorized entry. Yeah, okay, I get it. Yes, the season's opener is finally here. Can you feel the excitement in the air? It's like the calm before the storm. In just a few minutes, this place is going to go crazy. Okay. The stadium surrounded by numerous ports laid out in a circular fashion, so it's impossible to get lost. Turn here to get to dock number one. Okay. Here we go. There's treasures around these docks. And Oak is here too. The stores in the stadium are closed. But I'm always, I'm always active for business. Of course you are, sir. Let's see what he has. Does he have anything worth worth it? That's poison touch. MP. I want. I don't think I want any of this. The people here are so into the game they don't even look at what they're buying. You know what, Oaka? Love blitz, eh? <laughs> You're so sleazy. <laughs> you are so freaking sleazy. Let's see what equipment I have already. Do that. Oh. Uh, seekers. Okay, and he doesn't have anything else. Let's give you that armlet we got. Yeah. Okay. Let's do. I already got HP plus five. Okay, that's fine. Uh, he's got a lot of ones. Let's give him some dark ward. Yes, that's fine. We're gonna keep Brotherhood on him, though. For sure. Karen, I'm making a microwave cinnamon apples, and I'm very excited. Oh! How do you do them? How do you do yours? Do you just, like, put the cinnamon on the apples and then do the microwave and that's it? Let's give her MP. Yes. Okay. Well. Now that I can... see that. Okay, let's... yes and yes. Okay. Come all this way from Gagazet, Ronso's will surely win. I believe in you. Ice and snow from the holy peaks of Gagazet have strengthened Ronso's spirit. The Ronso Fangs will win the cup. Any Ronso know that. Just screams Frat Churquat, doesn't he? <laughs> Oaka, yeah. Uh, a fairy bound for Kilika is anchored here at dock number two. Okay. There's Trejar. Gimme that. Oh, I chopped them into small pieces and used cinnamon, brown sugar, and butter. Oh, that sounds so good. I don't have any apples right now, but maybe I should make some. Bougie cinnamon apples. Yeah. Oh, it's another Albed. I don't know what you're saying, sir. Sorry. Yeah, those do sound bougie, right? Like, do you do them in a pan? Instead of a microwave? Then it's, like, extra bougie. Okay, this is Doc 2. There any tre yeah, there's a treasure here. Obtain Phoenix down. Always need those. Move it out of my way. I'm busy sorting cargo. If you say so. Pretty sure there's like at least one treasure on each of these docks that you can get. 
Oh, here's where. Except for here. I don't think there's one here where the Guado came in. Lord Seymour will lead the Guado to eternal repose. Seems like they scaled back on security this year. Hope nothing bad happens. <laughs> Me too, sir. Me too. Don't confuse us with those heathen crusaders. Warrior monks are the true defenders of Yevon. What does that even mean? I hope you're at least good enough to do proper security. Seems like uh, those Guado don't uh, really trust you for that. Let's see. There. Oh, I guess there's not a treasure here. I thought there was one, but I guess not. Well, if I do in the oven, I might as well just make an actual apple pie. Oh, well, that's kind of true. Yeah, but you, but you don't have a crust. You have to go get a crust for that. Luca too hot for Ronso. Oh, yeah, all that fur, probably. Okay. There's a treasure back here. You gotta know how to get around it. There we go. Magic sphere. Hell yeah. And HP sphere. Hell yeah. That's what we like to have. Okay. Now we can go actually find Orin. I miss you, Daddy. We did two temples without you. Without you in my life. I make crust dough and freeze it for later use. Oh, that's smart. I just buy the crust from the store. But y'all know I'm not much of a cook. I'm really more about eating the food. Yeah, I mean, I guess they would freeze good, right? I just never do that. Just buy them, you know? <laughs> hey, Yuna. I'm sorry. Please let me through. Hey, let's go. You're really famous. <laughs> They have so much in common. I hope we don't get separated. You're Why would you say that? Huh? Hmm? What was that? <laughs> in Xanarkin, we do this to cheer on Blitz players. I can't actually do that. I mean, I can whistle, like... Right? But with the fingers, I can't do it. You I never figured to. it out. Put your fingers in your mouth like... This. Like this? Uh uh. Not like that. This. You're not demonstrating it very well, Titus. Then I can't follow you along. Just blow. It's not working. That's how it is for me Practice. too, Yuna. I understand. Okay. Hey, use that if we get separated. Then I'll come running, okay? <laughs> well, Guess we should just stick together then. Till you can do it. Yeah, you can't leave, Yuna. Yes, Don't run away or anything. Okay. We're supposed to go that way, but we're actually gonna go up this way. What do you have to say, Spear Theater? Um There's not really much to do up here, but there's a primer. So we gotta get that. I gave up the seafaring life. I've had enough of the storms and shipwrecks. I came to buy a spear, but I don't have enough money. Danger is part of a sailor's life. That's why I have no respect for gutless wretches who quit. Wow. Tell us how you really feel, sir. <clears throat> I've configured this monitor to display information on fiends roaming around the Luca area. Oh, okay. This is the band that you see everywhere. If it's our music you want to hear, then go to the back and buy a sphere. Okay. Yeah, you can buy, like, music and cutscenes and things here. Um, we're not going to do all that. We're literally here just for this guy. K to G. Hell yeah. A Mount Elbed Tippaman. Uh, no, I don't want to do any of this. Okay, I see you later. Probably not. I never really do this, do the sphere thing. Um, but if you really like to watch rewatch cutscenes and like the music in the game, this is where you can come to do that. The Sphere Theater in Luca. Okay, let's talk to these people. Hey, kiddo, got an extra ticket? I'll buy it off ya. Or how about I sell you front row tickets for you and the young lady? No thank you, we're looking for Orin. I'm keeping a close eye on the Albed Sykes this year. 
Ew, why would you root for the owl bed? You really do have bad taste. I like how they cover their faces. It's just so sexy and mysterious. Oh, oh, oh. Let's see what you're into. Well, I would have to say it's the Ronso Fangs for me. You're just making fun of your friend for masks, and you're over here like, give me the furry team. The Ronso, they're just a bunch of meatheads. And that's why the other teams are dead meat. I mean, she makes a convincing argument. I'm reporting to you live from outside Lucas Stadium. The excitement here has reached a fever pitch as the opening ceremony gets underway. <laughs> You're welcome. Keep up the antics throughout the tournament and I'll be sure to capture you on Sphere. Oh yeah. The people are indulging in merrymaking, but we must keep in mind that... I'll spare you the lecture. Thanks. Is it true that the fairy is out of service? I hear Sin may be lurking in the sea nearby. At any rate, who knows when we'll make it back to Kilika. I just wish the summoners would end this already. I'm working on it, sir. I am working on it. I have to play through the game, okay? It's a whole thing. Wow. This is a pretty big town. Luca is the second largest city in Spira. Wow. I thought every town was little, you know, like Besaid and Kilika. Towns don't usually get bigger than that. Because when a lot of people start to gather... Sin? Yep. Hmm. What about Luca? It's safe here? It's not any different, but the stadium is here. That's right. The Crusaders fight to protect it with all their strength. But they're not here they this year. They protect the stadium? Blitzball is really the only entertainment that we have. Hmm. Spira's a little short on fun these days. Whoa. Talk about pressure. <laughs> That's right. Is Xanarkand like this too? Nope. Lots of entertainment in Xanarkand. Hmm. Well, there are more buildings. All tall ones. And cramped together. Oh. They must be so tall. Don't you ever get dizzy? <laughs> we don't look up. Let's go find Sir Oren. Oh. That sounds so good, Thumper. I might have to get some apples and make some cinnamon apples. You'll have to excuse my child. He, I've never seen her quite so lively. Kids will be kids, I suppose. I got a red balloon. Bet you want one too. Maybe. Maybe I do. Give them a balloon and they're happy campers. Kids are so innocent. Tournaments are when we earn our cash. There's no time to waste now. If you say so. Another dog! Another dog! Welcome! Oh, do you have anything worth getting? Probably not. That's yeah, just like plus defense and stuff. I don't want that. Unnecessary. The manager says he's going to the game, so I got stuck looking after the place. It's not fair. All I wanted to watch the game and cheer the goers. Well, now you can't. You were on the sphere, right? Good luck in the game. But I still think the Oroch's victory is next to impossible. Don't lose hope. Believe in me. I hate it when it's, the cafe is so packed. Oh, sorry. Let's go in. Okay, so I'm just pausing here because I want to point out something so cool. So I remember in that first temple and I pointed out like all the script on the wall, right? And that was like a script that you see. There's multiple different scripts in this game. So down in the in the corner here, like I'll try to point to it in the webcam, like right here, this menu, that's another script that's used in the game. And they could have just written gobbledygook, right? Like just anything, whatever, it doesn't matter. But no, that actually says menu. And it lists actual items. It lists, like, eggs and stuff. I don't remember everything that's on there, but I saw a game. And I just I just think that is, like, the coolest. And you can actually find this script, like, everywhere that it is. And in pretty much every place, it actually says stuff that makes sense. Okay, I just wanted to point that out. Let's continue the scene. You know, you don't you see my unique model I'm going to win? Exactly, Thumper. We're going to try anyway. 
<sighs> Oren's not here. Nope. Hmm. Right? It's so cool, isn't it, Erica? I think it's like the neatest thing. This game is so detailed and everything is like so very specifically put together. Oh. Why not talk, Kimari? Not see Yenke for ten years. Wow. Say something. Maybe Kimari shoves us because they shove him. Forget Yenke? Forget Biran? Leave Kimari, Yenke. Kimari is small, Ranzo. Kimari so small, can't see Yenke and Biran's faces. Rude. <laughs> Kimari forget Ronso friends? We taught you much at time of Hornmolt. Biran taught Kimari to be strong, Ronso. Maybe taught too much. Take him on. <laughs> oh. Take it outside. The tournament's starting. You hear? These are Kimari's bullies. The game. We don't like Today, them. On this glorious day, players from all over Spira have assembled here to participate in this great contest of bravery, skill, and strength. Yeah. All of these fine teams, equally renowned, deserve to win the cup today. Such is the nature of this contest. Let us, the spectators, play our role accordingly. Let us sing to the glory of the winners and applaud equally the valor of the defeated. Thanks for the shout out. Contestants, may heaven be with you. Kajit has soul if you have coin. <laughs> Bree, what'd you spend money on? What'd you get? Was it food? Or was it fun? See, it says Luca. Like, in the script, it says Luca on the stadium. It's so cool. I love this game. You know, I kind of get what that girl says with the mask thing about the outbed, I'm not going to lie. It's very like Phantom of the Opera, right? It's very like Masquerade Ball. It's very like, um, you know, Labyrinth. That one dance scene. It's good. We're here for it. You can do it, Waka! You can do it. Believe in you. 20 bucks on stickers. On. Yuna's gone. Whoa. Clothes and a new beanie and sunglasses and a phone case. Romway is dangerous. <laughs> Where in Spira have you been? Huh? Looking for Orin. Yuna's been kidnapped by the Al Bed Sykes. Oh shit. In exchange for her safe return, they want the Aurochs to lose. What? Why didn't you whistle, if Yuna? Blitzball players. I doubt they'd do anything drastic. But we shouldn't take chances. Let's go get her. <gasps> I'm going too. This will be no problem. They're telling the Aurochs to throw the game, as if they needed to. I mean, how good a team can they be? Waka said the same thing. Mm -hmm. He'll take care of the game. We should go get Yuna. Okay. The Albed boat is in dock four. Let's go. Sure. Okay, but what we're actually gonna do? We're actually just, we're actually gonna save the game. <laughs> uh, and next time on Final Fantasy X, we will go save Yuna from the Albed Sykes. Because this is a really good stopping point. Because the next we'll do like the next chunk, right? So it's a good good break in the story. So let's save there. Okay. Um, I want to see. I want to see 
if we can fix the sound alerts. So if y'all will bear with me a minute with that, that would be awesome. Okay. Way. Let's switch over. I'll let y'all. We'll look. I'll have y'all so you can look at the Pokemon while we try this. All right. Google, come to me. Sound alerts. Do you have an FAQ or a troubleshooting thing? Help. This is a tutorial. Um, how can I use sound? Can I use sound alerts with slobs? Yes, that's what I'm using. Browser source not working. Browser source URL changed. How to implement. Da, 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 da. Multiple times at once. I used bits to trigger a sound alert and it didn't play on stream. Very sorry this happened to you. Please visit this page. Okay. Audio setting. Yeah, it's just literally... It's just literally not playing, though. Like, that's not the problem. None of their help has what I'm looking for. Because if I go into the sounds, like, I can play them and it'll work. Like, I'm going to do it again. Right? The plates. And if I go and do the applause here, it doesn't play. Okay, let's Google. Sound alerts do not play when live. This, so y'all can see what I'm Googling at least. Okay, let's switch it over. Let's do desktop so y'all can see everything. Best, best it's Labs alerts. Well, I don't want to open like my Streamlabs account on stream because I'm sure it'll show something that I really shouldn't show. But I feel like it's got to be a setting inside like my Streamlabs dashboard. You know what I mean? Let's see. All widgets, attention, da, da, da. okay, that's fine. Hmm. This, I have everything set mostly at default, you know what I mean? And yet it does not work. I might have to test this like, like stream, but not actually a stream that I'm planning on posting or that I care about. That might be what I have to do. This is boring and I really have no idea though. Is default for bits though? Yeah, um, it is. I don't know if I can, I don't know, I guess I can safely show it if I just go to bits. So if I go, I'll drag it over in a second. Think this shows anything bad yeah okay yeah so maybe erica since you know a little bit i know but the channel points isn't one here and you can do bits for them too no but you can do both so you can do both for this particular extension um the bits and the channel points like so i would i would think that if something in streamlabs if the settings are breaking it it will be something in the bits settings, right? Because it does, because it does both. Um, let me bring up the sound alerts page. I don't know. Have you ever done this? Have you ever done this for your stream, Erica? Used one of these type of um, things? Yeah, I don't have sound alerts for mine. Yeah, so like I have one set up for channel points, right? And if I do this, it works. But if I actually do it through this, it doesn't work. Even though it's like auto tied in and everything, it's really weird. What's this, Brie? GitHub. Automatically handled it. This seems like it's a totally different setup. Sounds like something you need to contact sound alerts about, Erica. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't know. It's really strange. Um, why would the test work and then not the real one? But yeah, I don't have anything like crazy turned on here. I googled it and someone linked to this. Oh. Okay. Well. OBS WebSocket. Yeah, I have no idea. This looks really complicated. It's, it's just supposed to work. Um, but I'll check that out. I guess I'll, I'll check that out after the stream. Let's do Pokemon. Let's do Pokemon because this is boring and stupid. I just wish I didn't have to go live to accurately test it. So that kind of annoys me. But I'll figure that out later. I'll figure that out later. Okay. Let's open it up. We're going to do some Gen 2. We're going to do some Gen 2 Pokemon this time. Go away. Too many things open. There we go. All right. We're going to do some Gen 2. So we're going to do the rock types for Gen 2 first. Ah, thank you so much, Erica. That I would really, really appreciate that. Yeah, if you're able to find anything too. I mean, I'm willing to try whatever. Might just have to do like a stream that's not a stream. Anyway, okay, Gen 2 rock types. So our choices are basically Sudowoodo, Shuckle, Magcargo, Corsola, and the Larvitar line. So we already put Corsola on there, right? So of course, we're going with the next cutest one for my rock type pick, and that is going to be Larvitar. So let's read about him. Let's read about him. It feeds on soil. After it has eaten a large mountain, it will fall asleep so it can grow. <laughs> it is born deep underground. It can't emerge until it's entirely consumed the soil around it. Born deep underground, this Pokemon becomes a pupa after eating enough dirt to make a mountain. It feeds on soil. After it's eaten a large mountain, it will fall asleep and grow. <laughs> so this thing basically eats mountains. I love it. The original link. Oh, fabulous. Thank you, Bree. Let me save that original over here. Okay, perfect. I'll take a look. Oh, it's a Reddit thread. Okay, perfect. I trust that. Okay, so here we go. Rock type. Larvitar. There he is. There he is up here. I love the tree sloppy Pokemon. That's so you. That's so you, Thumper. I'm not surprised. Okay, the next one that we're going to do is our dark type. So dark type was introduced in Gen 2, and it has four its dark type Pokemon. Umbreon, Murkrow, Sneasel, the Houndor line, and of course Tyrantar's Dark as well. So I love so many of these. Okay, I love so many of these. I love um, Houndor and Houndoom, and of course we've got an Eeveelution here, Umbreon, so we have to go for that. So we're actually going to add all three. So Houndor gets added as my Gen 2 dark type. Let's read about this little, this little fire puppy, this dark fire puppy. He looks like he has fire stuff, right? It uses different kinds of cries for communicating with others. So it's kind, uh, others of its kind and for pursuing its prey. To corner prey, they check each other's location using barks that only they can understand. Around dawn, its ominous howl echoes through the area to announce that it's its territory. It uses different kinds of cries for communicating with others of its kind for pursuing its prey. So it howls, basically, it's so, and it's so cute. It's so cute. Okay, let's go down to dark type. There we go. Snuggles too. Yes, he snuggles too. Um, I also really love Hound Doom. Let's read about him, and then I add him to my... Uh, favorite for the dark types. This is Hound Doom. It's so cute too, right? He's literally just bigger one, but he's still adorable. If you're burned by flames, it shoots from its mouth. The pain will never go away. Upon hearing its eerie howls, other Pokemon get the shivers and head straight back to their nests. The pungent smelling flame it shoots from its mouth results from toxins burning in its body. So it has like dragon logic, fire in the belly. If you're burned by the flames it shoots from its mouth, the pain will never go away. So it says the same thing again for Stadium 2. Okay, so here we go. I put him down for my... Oh, not that one. Ha ha ha, clicked the wrong one. Put him down for my Gen 2 fave. And then, y'all just saw, but we're going to do, do the, the whole thing to read him. My dark fave, of course, is then Umbreon. I love Eeveelutions. I mean, obviously, here, right? I love Eevee. 
I think it's the best Pokemon, it's my favorite, and I love all the evolutions. And Umbreon is a really cool one, right? He's like so like slick and neat looking. Okay, let's read about him. When agitated, this Pokemon protects itself by spraying poisonous sweat from its pores. When darkness falls, the rings on its body begin to glow, striking fear in the hearts of anyone nearby. On the night of a full moon, or when it gets excited, the ring patterns on its body glow yellow. So it literally glows. It's so, uh, so cool. So cool. Okay. Now for our last one that we're going to do today, we are actually going to do the legendary for this particular generation. So let's look at what all the legendary options are for Gen 2. Ninetales is my fave. Oh, Ninetales is such a good one. Such a good one. So for Gen 2, we've got, um, we've got the, the dogs, right? Raikou, Entei, and Suicune. And we've got the Regis. Um, I think that's in Gen 2. We've also got Lugia and Ho-Oh, right? And then we've got Celebi. So my choice, if y'all were here when we did the Gen, my favorite Gen 1 legendary, which is Articuno, then you know, obviously it's Suicune, right? I just love it. I, I love the ice types. I think it, the dogs are so cool. So let's read about him. Said to be the reincarnation of North Winds, it can instantly purify filthy, murky water. Handy, right? This Pokemon races across the land. It is said that North Winds will somehow blow whenever it appears. This divine Pokemon blows around the world, always in search of a pure reservoir. I understand. There we go. I put him in my Gen 2 legendary spot. Okay, so that's the Pokemon for this time. Here's how, how filled out we are. Let me move my camera so you guys can see the Umbreon in its slot. Where is it? Grab the webcam. Get up in the corner. So there's Umbreon down there and Houndor and Houndoom. And Tyrantar right there. Okay, I can go back in the corner. All right, so here's what I think I'm going to do. Let me switch it to the... All right, so here's what I think I'm going to do. Um, I'll do my little outro, we'll stop the stream, and then I'm going to go live immediately again and see if we can solve that sound alerts thing but of course that won't be posted or anything um we'll just do some testing and we'll bore my youtube audience with that <laughs> so thank you guys so much for coming to my stream um we played another round of final fantasy 10 today we are actually going to do something different next stream so make sure that you're in the discord so that you get updates on what that's going to be but don't worry we will get back to final fantasy 10 we're just going to take a short break right i don't want to play it every single week i don't want to get burnt out on it um, but I definitely want to finish it so that you guys experience that story with me. So we're going to take a pause on that. So take a little break on that cliffhanger. What happened to Yuna? Hopefully she's okay. Uh, so where can you find me? Here on Twitch, we stream on Thursdays at this time. That's Artistic License, which is my variety stream. We also stream on Saturdays. That's Interstage Window. And y'all need to be there on Saturday because Bree, who's in the chat right now, is going to be on Interstage Window and y'all don't want to miss that. Uh, it's going to be a really fun topic, so make sure you're in the Discord so that you get the updates on that topic. We also have my YouTube show, Spare Room, 2 p.m. on Wednesdays. You all know the drill by now. I have a TikTok, I have a Twitter, at It's Karen Terry. Down below, all the different ways that you can support me, which is Patreon. I've got PayPal for tips. Of course, you can subscribe to the Twitch channel if you want to. Um, I've got a book also on Amazon, everything in the about, all of that good stuff. You can find it. And, uh, and yeah, thank you so much for coming today. That's it. That's all. Okay. Bye, y'all. I will be right back. We're going to troubleshoot some sound alerts. If you're able to stick around, please do. And I really, really appreciate you if you do. Okay. Bye.